Hi, my name is Corey Beasley. I'm owner of DNA Fitness, and I'm going to show you how to do a squat, a Hindu squat, and a sumo squat. We're going to start with just a regular body weight squat. You're going to want to put your feet about shoulder width. You're going to want to have your toes pointed just about straight forward, maybe a little bit out to the sides. What you're going to do is you're going to keep your chest up, and you're going to sit back and come up slowly. You want your knees tracking over your second toe and your back and chest to be facing up. So you're just going to come straight down, back up, back up. From the side, you can watch my posture. I want to keep that back straight. Again, sitting back and coming straight up. Back, straight up. With the sumo squat, you're going to have your feet a little bit wider, a little bit further apart. You're going to want to point your toes out just about 45 degree angle. And again, it's the same idea, chest up, hips back, coming straight down, back up. That's going to hit a little bit more in the inner part of the thigh. So again, from the side, feet out, toes pointed out just a little bit, chest up, sitting back, back up. With the Hindu squat, the biggest difference is you're going to want to be on your toes. This is a body weight only exercise. You can have this just up on your toes. You're going to come down all the way. Your rear end is going to come down to your heels. Up and back down. I want you to inhale on the way up, exhale on the way down. From the side, up on your toes, chest up. You're coming all the way down and up, all the way down and up. And those are the three great variations for body weight squat.